Hey guys, this is Marlon B or Marlon from Facebook or MarlonB.etsy.com and this is my Casa Crew update video. Um, at the end, we will also have the results from my giveaway. Uh, this, this last couple of weeks have actually been really slow for me. Um, I've been just exhausted, um, you know, life stuff, I guess. I've just been really tired and I lost a lot of my knitting and crochet mojo. So I haven't really done all that much. I only have two finished projects or objects and one um, actual work in progress that I'm working on right now. Um, I'll show that to you guys. Uh, this is my first one and it was a work in progress last time. It is, and I completely forgot the name of it. Again, I know the patterns are on somewhere, but I forgot the name of it. Um, but it's a hat, obviously. I finished it up and it's just way too big. This was meant for me. It's, it's huge. Um, I definitely will have to I guess donate because I don't I personally don't know anyone that has a head this big <laughs> so I will have to be donating this um, I am really bad with um, although although now I have learned to make a gate a gauge swatch I'm still not getting the results I would hope to get even with that so that's kind of kind of disappointing for me uh, but it's just something I have to work on I guess uh, so that is one of my projects that are, are is completed. The other one is a little baby sweater. Looks like this. And this is a free pattern. Uh, the sweater itself actually has sleeves. But I did not... I chose not to add sleeves on because... I don't know if this is the correct size. Um, although I, I have less... Less issues uh, gauge-wise with crochet as opposed to knitting. Uh, sometimes I still have issues with it and this is really cute obviously it's a baby size and what I wasn't sure about is like the, sl the sleeves that, or the armholes I would say I don't know if they're big enough um, I don't have any babies um, I don't know anyone that has any babies it's probably been 10 plus years since I've been around one so I have no idea if I just messed it up with the holes if the armholes <laughs> are too small or not so I was like you know it probably will be for donation so uh, I just thought to myself I was not gonna add sleeves um, in case somehow or other they would make it better if the holes seem to be too tight I don't know if that makes sense that probably does not because if they're too tight then they're too tight whether there's a sleeve there or not so I'm just hoping somebody will be able to use this and again it's real sad that I don't even know how big is big enough for like a, a baby's, you know, cardigan or sweater, whatever. I am working on one other baby item, which is also a, a sweater. This one I at least have a pattern so I can show you guys. Um, in both of those patterns, a hat and the, the purple one I showed you, those are free patterns. I will be posting the links down below. Uh, this is the third one I'm working on right now. It's by Bernat. It's called Baby Coordinates. Oh, I don't know if that's a name or not. Oh no, I think that's a name. Sweet Baby Hoodie right here. And that's what it should look like. I am using some stash yarn. And I think this one, I don't know if I got from the stash or I got from somewhere. Um, I got two, two skeins of it. Um, not Either of them did not have labels. So I have no idea what the brand of yarn is, uh, what the type of yarn it is specifically. Although I'm pretty sure it's baby yarn, uh, just by the by the way the colors are working up and everything. I'm pretty sure it's some type of baby yarn. But this is how much I have completed. Right now I'm working on the sleeves, and I actually do not think I'm going to have enough uh, enough yarn to complete the sleeves and to complete the hood as well. Cause this pattern has a hood on it and I really would want to add that on just so I know how hoods work. I've never made um, any item with a hood on it so I think that'll be fun to, to try out. So I'm thinking if anything, if I don't have enough yarn to finish the sleeves, I'm just gonna use a, uh, another color that cords knit with this, the coordinates that that goes well with this one. <laughs> and I'm gonna finish up the sleeves with that and then make the hood in that same color. Oh, and also the, the button band as well, since obviously I didn't make that yet. 
But this is what it looks like so far. Pretty cute. The only annoying part, or at, at least for me, it's kind of annoying, is that the pattern, or via the pattern, you make the back separately, you make the front panel separately, when it will be so much easier, at least for me, to make it all in one piece, since I don't really like sewing pieces together in general, but I think if I ever remake it again, I probably will try that out. But that is what I'm working on right now. Nothing else I'm really working on. Again, I've just have been wanting to just sit there and relax. I've been, did I already say that? I've been watching a lot of Netflix. Um, I usually would, if I'm just relaxing, I usually would, you know, have like uh, my games or something. But even that seems like too much work right now, if that makes sense. So that's kind of sad. So I, I really have just been sitting there and watching, you know, Netflix or browsing, um, or, you know, just reading, whatever. So that is what I'm working on. And that's all I've finished. I do not know if it's going to get better <laughs> uh, by the next time I um, I come to make an update. I'm hoping to have some stuff completed for you. But uh, I cannot make any promises, unfortunately, because right now it's just been really, really slow. But let me get to that giveaway. Uh, let me grab my list here. Uh, we had uh, 24 entries this time. I printed out all the comments and if you guys want to review the comments uh, in the video, of course you can do so. You can see who entered, etc. But I did print and put them all out all here. We have 24 in general. And let me actually go, go get my phone so I can do that number, the random number generator. One sec. Okay, I have my phone here and hopefully you guys can see it. I put the minimum one and the maximum is 24 since we do have 24 entries. Uh, so let's see. Oh, and for this one, you guys know that we're going to have three winners. The first one is number 19. That would be Happy Crochet Knits. Happy Crochet Knits. Congratulations. Right here. Number 19. The next one would be number 22. And that is Chelsea Tooley. And I hope that I'm saying that correctly. But here you are, number 22. Congrats. And last but not least, the third winner would be number 15. Who would that be? It is Sarah Green. Congratulations, Sarah. Now if you guys uh, can please contact me. You can do it via YouTube if you want to send me a message or if you know me on Facebook, um, you can also send me a message, a message via there as well. Just let me know your address. Um, I actually didn't, oh, I didn't read your, over your comments, but if you did not specify uh, which skin you would prefer, um, I would probably be doing it randomly, uh, you know, sending it off to you guys randomly. Um, but try to let me know maybe within a week or so or yeah, I would say a week, a couple of weeks maybe, uh, so I can send them off to you as soon as possible. Again, con congratulations, you guys. Thank you everyone for entering. Um, I hope you guys have a great couple of weeks and I will see you again soon. Bye.